Hey, Dex Guides here with another achievement guide on FIFA 21. This is the natural talent achievement worth 15G, which you get for winning a penalty shootout without missing a goal. So, obviously, what we're going to do is we're going to use two controllers for this and do a quick play match. Obviously, you can choose any teams you want. I would go into the settings of the game before you start the game to make sure it is five minutes a half so that you have the fastest game possible. Then, pretty much all you're going to do throughout the whole game is just sit there and wait. You can mess about a bit and take shots, practice shooting, practice free kicks, whatever you want to do. So, you might have recognised there that that particular thing there was based off my free kick video which came out earlier. Once you finish the match, it has to be in a draw and you can see one of the options is for penalties, which obviously we're going to choose. So, this is really, really simple from here. It's only going to take three penalties each. All you've got to do is move the goalkeeper out of the way with your controller you want to lose to the left. And with the controller you want to score with, just aim using your left analogue stick to the right-hand side a bit. And then just tap the B button. Tap it lightly. and So, literally just a quick tap. And it will go into the goal and the keeper will have no chance because you're not going to dive because you're not telling the keeper to dive as you see there. Then with your second controller, when it comes to them taking a the penalty, then just literally blast it. Now don't do what I did there, which is thinking if I just press and hold B, it's just gonna sky whatever I do. Because it turns out it doesn't sky whatever you do. And if you press the ball to the bottom of the goal, even at full power, it does have a chance to go in. So at this point, we should be losing the match as soon as Sunderland miss this penalty kick, which they will do here, as we see. Um, but instead, we need to score one more goal but it's just going to be as easy as ever. And once the goal goes in, we will win the match with the controller that we want to get the achievement with. You can obviously do this with the AI and you have a good chance of winning without missing, but there is a chance of the goalkeeper just randomly going in the right direction and then causing you to lose. So once the game's finished, you do have to continue a little bit before the achievement will pop. You need to go to the end winner screen. So not the match result one, the one that's next after that that says winner and then your gamer tag and then the achievement pops at the bottom as you can see there. So I hope this guide helps out for you. If it does, please hit that like button, click subscribe for more daily guides and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!